had. So today we are going to see uh, how to check whether this particular SCR, silicon control rectifier, is working or not. So I'm, I'm holding an SCR like this, right? You can see the flat surface that is at the bottom. I'm going to hold like this. And there are three terminals in the SCR. The three, three terminals are named as the leftmost, I'm going to start with the leftmost terminal. This is the cathode, anode, and the gate. So this is the illustration. You can see here the three terminals are the cathode, anode, and the gate. I'm going to check whether this particular device is working or not. So we have used, we have connected this particular SCR in the breadboard. So as you can see here, this is the first terminal, cathode, anode, right? You can see here over here, right? This is the cathode, this is the anode, and this is the gate. So cathode is connected over here, anode is connected at this particular slot, cathode is connected over here. This is cathode, this is anode, right? This is anode, and this is the gate. Open one is the gate. This open one is the gate. Now let us check with the multimeter whether do we have any resistance over here. Right, I'm going to connect this anode and cathode. I'm going to check whether the resistance are there. But I will not be getting any resistance because of a reverse blocking region over here. And if I even change the polarity, you will not get it. Until otherwise, I trigger this gate. When I trigger this gate, there will be resistance flowing in. Let us check this. Right, the first step, I'm going to take this polarity, anode. This black is as the cathode. Right, so we have the anode over here, the cathode over. So in this particular illustration, we have the cathode over here, we have the anode over here. Now let us see whether we get any resistance, the cathode and the anode. So there is no resistance. Even if I change the polarity, there is no resistance, right? There is no resistance. Now I'm going to take, take the anode and this is the cathode. The cathode I have connected over here, right? The anode I have connected over here. Now let us see what happens if I trigger it, right? Just tap it. See, you can have the trigger and you have about 675 ohms flowing in this particular SCR. So it says that SCR is functioning. Thank you.